Do you want to know a trick to instantly command more respect and look more professional? It all comes down to the right size. And in this context, I'm talking about the size of your shirt colors and of the lapels of your sports jackets. Let's take the TV show Suits, for example. Maybe you've watched it, maybe you haven't. But the two protagonists are Mike Ross and Harvey Specter. And just by looking at this picture and the way they dress, can you guess which one is more superior to the other, which one is more senior? You probably guess Harvey Specter and you would be right. If you haven't seen the show, so Harvey Specter is pretty much one of the best lawyers in New York. And Mike Ross is super intelligent, but he just started at the company. So in order to show the different status that they have in the firm, the costume designer did a very nice trick when choosing the suits. So you can see that Harvey Specter, he has very wide lapels, he has peak lapels, whereas Mike Ross, he has very small lapels and he also has the regular notch lapels. And the thing is that wider lapels just always makes you look more professional and more senior. I learned this from Hugo Giacomi from Zotorio Talks here on YouTube. Great channel, make sure to check it out. And he spoke about the fact that one of the brands that first actually made this commercial was Hugo Boss. And then afterwards, a couple of other companies followed suit. So having super small lapels is more of a fashion statement. It's more of a style statement. It's not really a classic style. The funny thing is that having really thin lapels, it just looks a little bit like something is missing. But one thing to keep in mind is that the size of your lapel also has to fit your body type. So you can see also Mike Ross is a little bit of a slimmer guy and the thinner you are, the slimmer you are, the thinner your lapels should be as well. They should never, in my opinion, be super thin, but they should definitely be thinner than from someone who's more on a heavier side. So when you build a little bit wider, a little bit heavier, then having wide lapels fits really well and having small lapels would look really weird. So keep that in mind when you're shopping for sports jackets. The problem is when you buy secondhand, I buy again most of my things secondhand, then you don't have that much choice. And most of the brands that you can buy secondhand, they have kind of small lapels. So I wish it was different, but pretty much every one of my sports jacket has small lapels. The one I have right now, that's one of the secondhand items I bought with the widest lapels. This is from Hackett London. I bought it secondhand for about $50, I think. A couple of other brands that I find secondhand that also have wider lapels are usually from Italy. So for example, Canali, Bolioli, Brioni, or also Zenia, or even Brooks Brothers as well. But being here in Germany, we find more Italian brands. We don't really have a lot of American brands. When you're based in the States, you probably have a lot of secondhand Brooks Brothers. Here in Germany, we pretty much don't have it at all. And moving on to the shirt color, this is also something learned from from Ugo Giacomi from Satoru Talks. And that is that the shirt color should always be big enough to fit under your lapel. Because if you have a really small shirt color and it's somewhere in the middle, you see this a lot with politicians, it looks a little bit off. It looks much nicer if it's long enough to fit under the lapel. And I wish I knew about this sooner because three years ago, I bought a couple of white dress shirts here in Germany. And again, most of the stuff that you get in the mall here in Germany at least, is pretty much fashionable. So small lapel on the suits, also small shirt colors. And this one is so small, I actually wish I wouldn't have bought it, but I'm showing you some images here to compare the different colors. And you can see it looks much nicer when you have a shirt color that's wide enough to go under your lapel. Again, there's so many different variations of shirt colors and it really depends on the shape of your face, which one fits you the best. But this is a topic for a completely different video. So in conclusion, try to buy shirt colors that fit under your lapel and also try to find sports coats with lapels that are a little bit wider. They don't have to be super, super wide because it can also be a little bit extreme sometimes, but they should have a decent size. But again, don't despair because with second hand, we have to work with what we can find. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a comment and a like below. Subscribe to the channel and see you next time.